Borat Pierre. Borat Pierre. And I forgot his name, but the, I know it's two of them, but the main actor. Uh, uh, Ram Charan Junior NTR. The one that is in the military in the beginning and then, you know, sets. Oh, Ram Charan. Yes, yes. What, is, what a fantastic actor, honestly. And uh, I hope, I, I kind of hope this movie would have more visibility, uh, you know, over here in Europe and in the States. And I know it, it was, it, it went to the Oscars. <laughs> okay, I wanted to get validated by you, my French accent that you've been practicing off the camera. It's actually, I'm not, I'm not trying to be uh, flattering. You have a perfect bonjour, honestly. Yeah. Thank you. I framed it and uh, I put it uh, above my bed. So every, every, every day I wake up to this substantial sight and I remember who I am in this world and it, it gives me the stamina to, you know, uh, move through the day with, with, with you, you, you know, knowing what it's all about. Yeah, I, I feel enough when I when I remember that third position on Six Men People Six Men Alive magazine. Hello, everybody. I'm Nodrani, and welcome to Zoom Speak Easy. My guest today is your favorite French man. Of course, you've fallen in love with him so many times, and he also happens to be in the Sexiest Man Alive list. Of course, talking about Lucas Bravo. Thank you for joining in. Hi, thank you for having me. Like I said, bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> okay, I wanted to get validated by you with my French accent that you've been practicing off the camera. It's actually, I'm not, I'm not trying to be uh, flattering. You have a perfect bonjour, honestly. Yeah. Thank you. But like I said in my introduction, you are the favorite Frenchman for a lot of movies. And... Um, also, how have you been dealing with the sexiest man life tag? It's been a while now, uh, and you're, you know, you seem to get a lot of love every every time. Well, I framed it and uh, I put it uh, above my bed. So every, every every day I wake up to this substantial sight, and I remember who I am in this world, and it it gives me the stamina to you know, uh, move through the day. With, with with you 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 know knowing what it's all about yeah I, I feel enough when I when I remember that third position on six men people six men alive magazine it's important it's important to to experience that once in a lifetime I'm sure it is did that come up during discussing any conversation with Mr Clooney considering both of you are on the same list actually uh, on a serious note he, he, when when we started shooting in uh, Ticket to Paradise in uh, in Australia, I, I wanted to prank George. Um, I didn't know if it was a bad or a good idea, but I knew that he was a prankster, and I was like, you know, I'm 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 gonna get yeah. into. This. I'll I'll end my career there, but at least uh, I'll live with panache. And I so I put all his sexist sexist men life cover uh, on all the background of all the laptops in the hotel where we were staying at because he, he he's been sexist men life twice, I think, and so. Uh, I put them all over the place and he was everywhere and uh, he took it pretty well, actually. But that was the start of our relationship. A pretty good one, I assume. <laughs> yeah. But no, fantastic. Okay, I have one minute, so I need to like ask really short questions and get short answers. I'm going to go for it. Okay, are you ready? <laughs> yes, fire up. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, um, what's one quality of, uh, you know, your character, Gabriel, that you love and you don't like? I love his uh, I love his uh, feminity, and I don't like his an an ability to communicate. Perfect. Okay, one quality from the following names that I'm going to say right now that you admire: George Clooney, generosity, Lily, uh, professionalism. Okay. It's Julia Roberts. Pronounce it, Julia. Uh, I would say, of. Uh, um, I would say humor. You, humor. How how do you? Yeah, humor. Humor. Yeah. humor. You got it right. Sense of humor. Yeah. She is funny, isn't she? She's so much funnier than you you would believe. Like she's already funny, like on TV, on talk shows, and stuff like that. But she's yeah. she's crazy uh, on set. She's so funny. She has such a such a particular sense of humor. And it, it's very similar than British and French humor. So not everybody gets it, but once you get you get the the vibration, it's uh it's 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 the best. 
Okay. Uh, is there a stereotype about French people that you absolutely dislike? Yes, that we're, that we're um, mean and unwelcoming. <laughs> okay, of course. Look at him, he's so welcoming. Again, the last one, of course, is, uh, is there any Indian movie or Indian actor that you've heard of or you like? You know what? I just, uh, I just, I was so into RRR uh, a few months back and I forgot okay. his name, but the, I know it's two of them, but the main actor. Uh, uh, Ram Charan, Junior NTR. The one that is in the military in the beginning and then, you know, sets. Oh, Ram Charan. Yes, yes. What a, what a fantastic actor, honestly. And uh, I hope, I kind of hope this movie would have more visibility, uh, you know, over here in Europe and in the States. And I know it, it was, it, it went to the Oscars, but uh, I wanted more for this. But this actor is fantastic. The amount of, of, of you know, you know uh, stunts and, uh, and fighting and, uh, an emotional presence he has in this movie is, is breathtaking. So well put. Thank you so much. And for all the Indian fans, can you say Bohat Pyar, which means lots of love? Bohat Pyar. Bohat Pyar. <laughs> is, it, is it, did I pronounce it well? Bohat Pyar. Bohat Pyar. Bohat Pyar. Bohat Pyar. <laughs> Thank you. Got it. Thank you so much.